the heart of a shrimp is on its head. However, if we consider the precise anatomy of a shrimp, its heart is located on the thorax, just below the head. Both the head and the thorax are covered by a single exoskeleton, and this is why the thorax is often mistaken for the head. It's important to note that a shrimp consists solely of the head and the tail. Due to the protection offered by the head over the tail, shrimp house their hearts and other vital organs inside their head, such as their gastrointestinal, cardiovascular, reproductive, and neurological systems. The thickest and most robust parts of the body are the head and thorax. This area is covered by a thick layer of protective material known as the exoskeleton, also known as the cephalic portion. The exoskeleton of a shrimp is composed of chitin, a protein substance with a rigid structure. Its strength derives from its fibrous makeup. The exoskeleton protects the vital organs of the shrimp as any damage to them would clearly be fatal. This is how shrimp have evolved to maintain their survival over time. As blood circulates throughout the body, it enters and leaves three pairs of hearts. Unlike the human heart, which has two pairs of chambers, two atria at the top and two ventricles at the bottom, this structure only has one chamber. Shrimp have a small heart with one chamber and three openings called ostia. These openings in the heart's wall permit blood to enter the heart. They have small auxiliary hearts that circulate the blood throughout their body. Crustaceans have an open circulatory system, which means that not all their blood is contained within vessels. Rather, blood is pulled into the heart through ostia and then pumped out to circulate through the tissues and back to the heart. Unlike human hearts, crustacean bodies must coordinate the opening and closing of several valves to ensure oxygenation underwater. These are Interesting Things with J.C.